I just got this camera bag and I absolutely freaking love this thing. It's by Peak Design. No, not sponsored, but hey man, I thought, you know what, 250 might be a lot for a backpack. And I was wrong. This backpack was worth every single penny. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay here. And if you ended up clicking on this video, I'm assuming you're here for the Tesla content. So that's what we're gonna get to today. But before we get that started, quick message from the sponsors of this video. If you guys would like to support, all of that info is down below in the description. Don't forget to place your orders because I am ending the pre-orders very soon. If you want something, make sure you grab it ASAP. Anyway, let's get this video started. It's a Croc and Polo PJs kind of day. Damn it. So before we get started, I want to show you guys the kit with everything in it. So if you guys are interested in purchasing this, I will have a link down below. This is not a sponsored video in any sort of way. I bought this with my own money, but if they want a sponsored video in the future, you know where to hit me. Email down below. It looks like it comes with some tape. We also have this controller harness thingamabob. We got a little cigarette charger. I believe this is how it turns on and turns off. And then we have our little light tubes right here. Seems like a pretty simple setup. I don't really know exactly how to do everything, but I'm sure we could figure it out together. Uh, let's get it started. I'm gonna see how long it takes me to install all of this. Cause sometimes I know you guys are bored. It's quarantine. You're trying to chill at home, but you're trying to do something as well. So if you want to do something that's not super time consuming, this might be it for you. I'll go ahead and test it out and let you guys know. All right, let's gather our stuff and let's go into the car. All right, and we are inside the car now. So the main reason I wanted to add some lights to this setup right here is because at nighttime, I just feel like the vibes would be so much nicer if we had a little bit of, you know, strip lighting going on this area. So I figured, you know what? Let's go ahead and do it. If you guys are wondering about the wrap, I got it done by Premium Auto Styling. They went ahead and surprised me with this Louis Vuitton crazy wrap right here with my logo. It might be a little bit too much for a lot of people, but again, this is my car, so we're doing it crazy out here. I believe this kit also comes with the dash trim as well, but I'm not gonna be doing this. I feel like that was a little bit too much. I might change my mind in the future, but for now, we're just gonna be focusing on this center console area right here. Let's see how everything goes. So the first thing we're gonna do is unbag this right here, which is going to be where the light is traveling through, all right? So there's a lot of cables in here. Like I said, I'm pretty sure one is for like the uh, the dash, maybe. It's a snake, anaconda. Ah! We got two shorter ones right here. Side note, this camera is stupid nice. Oh my God. All right, let's get it. As you guys can see, we got a little tip right here. On the other end, we have a bigger tip. So this one is going to go towards the back, the big tip one. The smaller tip is gonna to go towards the front up there. Now, what I noticed is the two pieces are a little bit different. If you guys could see this hook right here, there's a flat side and then there's a hook side. We want the hook side to be towards this silver piece right here. That's what it hooks onto in the back. The kit came with a little spatula, okay? So we're gonna get it in here, just like that. That sounded kind of crunchy. We'll get it in there like that. Just to get the crevice going, just to get this thing started. All right. Once we're in there like swimwear, now we could just scoot it up. We are gonna scoot it up, get it all up in there. So we're gonna work this all the way up here. After you're done doing that, that should probably take you about, I don't know, like five minutes to do. Maybe even quicker if you guys are able to just get this in real nice. You push it up all the way up here until you can't do it anymore. And then everything will be seamless. It'll run all the way back here. And I haven't pushed it all the way back in yet because I'm not sure where we're supposed to end this. 
but I'll figure that out in a little bit. So I got both of those sides all done, complete, and then I decided to run it all the way back because at first I was thinking, you know, it might have to dip down here a little bit or do some weird stuff, but in actuality, it probably should run all the way back here. So that is all good. Everything should clear. I'll do a check with you guys again after I uh, wire everything up. But the next step is probably going to be almost this. This will be the last step. We're going to connect this to the box. This box basically controls all the lights, the colors, flashing, all that good stuff. Pretty sure this is the last step. We're just going to unscrew this, put the end of this piece into here, screw it back up, and then we'll plug it into the cigarette lighter and then everything should be good. I think that's it. All right, how do y'all think we did? You just go ahead and screw that in and then here comes the final part. This goes into the cigarette lighter and I believe this probably on off, on off. All right, moment of truth. Let's try it out, babies. Comment right now, what color do you think is gonna be straight out of the packaging? I'm gonna go with red. You guys comment down below, don't cheat. Ooh, it's blue. Oh my goodness. I definitely have to wait until nighttime to show you guys this. You're not gonna be able to see this during the day. The last part, does it close? Oh yeah. Let me know what you guys think about this one. Do you think this is a cool mod? This is probably, if I'm not mistaken, maybe, I wanna say maybe 40 bucks. Pretty cool, even though I can't see the entire thing, it's pretty cool, man. So here's the app. This is what it looks like when you first open it. I'm trying to connect to what I have going on right here. So I should probably turn the lights back on. Group management, lamp list. All right, we could figure that out. Let's go. My devices, probably this one right here. Paired. Look at that, guys. We could change all the colors right here. Looks like they got a bunch of them. We're gonna mess around with this a little bit later. While we wait for that, if you guys aren't subscribed yet, what are you guys doing? Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and leave a comment down below. Let's see, what should y'all say today to confuse the people that skipped? We're commenting a bunch of eggplant emojis down below. If you guys watched this video entirely and didn't skip, eggplant emoji gang down below, baby, let's go. And if you guys are considering buying a Tesla Model 3 and you're just watching my videos because you're just lurking on Tesla, Model 3 stuff. I do have a link down below that will get you 1,000 free supercharger miles. So if you're gonna buy one or you know somebody that's gonna buy one, hook them up. The link is down below. Anyways, gotta cook dinner in a little bit, so we're gonna do a little bit of the food network. So I hope y'all are hungry and I hope you're ready for some Korean barbecue. Let's get it! Ooh, oh man, dinner was amazing. I'm ready to see the lights. Are you guys ready? Let's get it. Sheesh. We got a freaking light show in here, boys. Super nice. I'm gonna mess with the settings right now just to show you guys how we could customize it. So obviously it's all changing colors. Basically any color you want. This purple is really nice. I'm digging the purple. I don't know, you guys let me know. Do you dig the purple? I didn't think that they would glow like this, to be honest. I thought it was gonna be a lot more dim, but um, in the app, I guess you could control the brightness of everything. So if I want it to be a little bit more dim. Oh, see that? Do you see that? Make it brighter. That's the brightest right there. And then if we want it to be just a little bit, we get a little hint right there. So that's pretty cool. I like that. Three color jumping change. Nah, it's a little too much. So I like this one. This one is called the purple gradual change and we could change the speed on this too. So it's going a little bit too fast. So let's change the speed and slow it down a bit. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Slightly changing, you guys see that? Slowly, slowly, slowly. This is the one, this is it right here. I'm digging this one so much. Now it makes me want to do the dash. So I might do that in the next video. You guys let me know what you think. Is that doing too much? Should we just do the center console or should we do the dash as well? Let me know in the comment section down below. And if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and don't forget to pick up some merch. Again, pre-orders will be closing very soon. So I appreciate all you guys' support as always. I'll see you guys next time. It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay. I'm out. Peace.